Young people showcasing special talents. Drama. Choreography. Poetry. Singing and dancing. These are youth of the Church of Pentecost, Danfa Assembly, and Amrahia District. The youth have made me to just go back to my olden days. Even though I'm a pensioner, I wanted to join them as a youth. So I tried to dance, do everything, but my waist. Here, their counterparts at the Church of Pentecost, Amon's Assembly, and the Labone District La Area are also performing various activities to show their talent to the delight of a large congregation. <laughs> Drama. Choreography. Poetry. Singing and dancing. The Church of Pentecost is marking its biannual youth week times when young people are encouraged to play leading roles in the church and guided to be responsible citizens. With respect to our theme, it says that remain in the anointing and I think that that alone is a lesson enough that we should all take. It was super, it was awesome, like power pack. We would move on in life and then we would also um, bear more fruits for Jesus. Today's service was awesome. The worship was dope. Everything was amazing. It was power packed all together. Presiding elder of Imam's Assembly, Elder Nana Boachi, advised young people to dedicate time and resources to develop their skills and talents as that could transform their lives and the nation. <laughs> Said the Bayer or more in Yenia, not that in Yasu, and you have a sorry no any good future. Say, oh, yeah, youth, that's a Usia, a dear papa, oh, youth age now. A bet to my boy, I'm a overcome retirement and over enjoy life. Today's service, I would say, if I'm to compare today's service to previous meetings that, that have been the leader, I would say today's one is exceptional and awesome. The program is once in every two years, so this was an opportunity for us to rejuvenate the youth for the kingdom work. Presiding elder of Danfa Assembly, Elder Samuel Yirinchi also called on the youth to shun all immoral acts, dedicate their life to Christ, and contribute meaningfully to develop their society. And for youth ministry as a whole, we had a great opportunity and we all show what we can do to praise God, to show our talent. My little advice to my colleague, the young people, that they should abstain from sex, immoral life, and they should stay away from drugs, especially with this trauma and those stuff. From Accra, this is Gabriel Ni Obodai Togwa Ashon reporting for Metro News. Oh, <laughs>